morning and welcome in. I am sitting over here at the Flying J in Minot, North Dakota. Just went in and had me a bite to eat over there and uh, now we're ready to uh, get back on the road and uh, put the hammer down. Well, here we go. We are just about to hit the border. We got the duty free here on the right. As you can probably see. Yeah. And we are going to be in Saskatchewan here right away. Got a couple of trucks ahead of me here, but today is not bad. I've been here where it's been way worse. Oh yeah. But it's been pretty windy today. Not doing so good in fuel mileage, but hey, what can you do, right? At least it's not a long line up here today like it was one time here before when I come across here. It was like half an hour line up over here. It was way back there. like Crossing border. Entering Saskatchewan. Yep. We are in Saskatchewan. Anyways, we'll see you guys on the other side. Here we are. We are officially in Saskatchewan. It didn't take us very long at all. I was just kind of curious on what this guy is doing up here. I just thought he's coming the wrong way, but I don't think he is. I guess he's going into the uh, meat inspection or whatever, livestock inspection up there. I guess that's where it is. Yep, here we are. Highway 39. That's what it's called up here in Saskatchewan. Yeah, about 40 clicks and we will be in Astawan, Saskatchewan. Well, here we go. One of the big valleys that we got up here. Going down pretty good. We got even some oil, uh, oil pumps up here to the left. I don't know if you were able to see that, but yeah, it's uh, pretty hilly up here. Not mountains or anything like that, but it's... Uh, not flat at all. I don't know what they do up here. I don't know what they live off of. We just stopped in uh, Moose Jaw, Saskatchewan. Went and uh, fueled up over there. Needed to get some fuel, so we're gonna get me some Canadian fuel again. Because up here in Canada, they put more uh, chemicals in there. So that way, uh, the fuel doesn't freeze up as easily, you know. And I was pretty uh, pretty low on fuel already anyways. Fueled up 200 gallons worth of fuel. Well, 200 US gallons, that's what I fueled up. So that was quite a bit. Cost me $837 up here in Canada. That's Canadian dollars though. There you got another four hours to go and then we will be in uh, Madison Hat. That's going to be good. I got uh, 3.30 this afternoon right now. So we should be there about uh, 7.30 I would say, 7.45 we should be uh, in Madison Hat. Now we'll drop our trailer and We'll see, maybe the dispatch will send me something here today yet, if not then hopefully tomorrow. Well, we have officially dropped our trailer here in Madison Hat, uh, Alberta. And as you guys probably going to be able to tell, I am tired. I think I'm just going to go straight to bed. Yep, I think that's what I'm going to do. But we got ourselves a good day worth of driving behind us. Got about a thousand and twenty-five kilometers in altogether. Now that's a really good day worth of driving. I think that's probably about seven hundred miles. And that's not that easy to do, you know. But we got it done. That's all that matters. We got the load here on time. They want it here today and we got it here today. 
So I guess with that we will see what we got tomorrow. Hopefully we get ourselves a reload tomorrow and then uh, we should be able to get back home. So I guess we will call it a day and we will see you again tomorrow at 5 a.m. So thanks for watching. Thank you.